Last week on The Right Stuff, it was all about speed and marksmanship as the guys went head-to-head -head in the American Nissan X's and O's and Long Range Challenge. After circling four barrels on the course, they had to make their way back to the start to shoot a Tannerite target at 100 yards. Daniel, Don, Drew, and Ray were neck and neck, but it was Raleigh with Team Titan who tore up the course with the Nissan Titan truck and was able to zero in with the Vortex Razor Scope mounted on an Armalite AR-15. He was successful in taking out the Tannerite target and returns today along with his fellow competitors to see who has the fastest time and who will win today's challenge. Hold on tight, because the right stuff starts now. Welcome back, gentlemen, to day four of The Right Stuff, season five. Our five competitors have returned and are prepared for the Polaris Power Ranger and Long Range Challenge. Speed is the name of the game when it comes to the Polaris Power Ranger, but precision shooting with the Surgeon 308 will make all the difference to see who has the right stuff. Welcome back, gentlemen. Hope you had a good night's sleep. Today, we have the Polaris Ranger Challenge. We're going to mix a little bit of speed with a little bit of accuracy, and we'll see who comes out on top. Let's look to the narrator to see what we have in store. Thanks, Will, and welcome to the exciting Polaris Power Ranger and Long Range Challenge. Today, our competitors will maneuver the Polaris Ranger XP around three barrels and return back to the starting line. From there, they must jump out of the Polaris and run to the shooting platform where they will lie in a prone position and use a Surgeon 308 rifle fitted with a Vortex scope and loaded with Nexus ammunition. They will have to control their breathing as they shoot across 100 yards at a Tannerite target. The competitor with the fastest time and sharpest aim will take home the winning bullet. Back to you, Will. Okay, gentlemen, let's get started. Ray, you're first. And Riley, if you'll lead us out. My name is Michael Watson. And Chad Spears. We are uh, the daily operators of Polaris Fun Center in Bryan, Texas. We're a single line Polaris dealer. Uh, the Ranger Series is the number one seller in the UTV market by any brand uh, and had been for quite some time. They've got a pretty diverse lineup. They've added a brand new Ranger 1000 this year for 2018. It's got a lot of new designs to it. Has some extra onboard storage. Has more ground clearance than any other one in that class. Also has class leading towing up to 2,500 pounds now. The crew cab Ranger is by far bread and butter, especially here in the state of Texas. We sell way more of those than we do anything else. They also add the North Star Edition, which is AC and heat. The only one in the industry that uses a gasoline engine. All the other manufacturers that have had it, they've done it with diesel. Come down and see myself or Chad um, or visit us online at uh, www.polarisfuncenter.com. The Right Stuff is brought to you in part by American Titan, G-Shock, Armalite, Surgeon, and Tannerite. The Right Stuff is brought to you in part by Glock, Vortex, Nexus Ammunition, Tough Products, and Polaris Fun Center. Pro Shot Products. Our family heritage and passion for the shooting sports has been passed down through the generations. For 35 years, we've added quality products to our line so that we now have a complete line of firearms, cleaning supplies, and splatter shot targets. 
Our quality cleaning rods and accessories are made of steel and brass, not plastic. This makes cleaning faster and easier. Firearm cleaning products and splatter shot targets are all made in the USA. That's Pro Shot Products. Welcome back to day four of The Right Stuff. The stage is set with the Surgeon 308 mounted with the Vortex Scope and the Polaris Ranger XP waiting at the starting line. First up, Ray Churnside with Team Block. Go. Next up is Daniel Wolf with Team Armalite. Next up is Drew Pearson with Team Tannerite. Next up is Don Bryson right, with Team G-Shock. Stand by. Go! Next up is Raleigh Hart with Team American Titan. Driver, you ready? Stand by. Go!
wow, did you see that Polaris fly? Not to mention the Tannerite target positioned 100 yards away that was blown to smithereens by the Surgeon 308 rifle. These guys really stepped it up in today's challenge. Let's check back in with Will. All right, guys, good job today. You all were very fast and you were very close to each other in time. Let's head back to the Campfire Army and find out the results. With me is Craig Beckman, Director of Marketing for Strategic Armory Corporation. And he's gonna tell us a little bit about the Surgeon Rifle you've been seeing all week. Sure, so we're uh, using a Surgeon Scalpel with a 591 short action. It's in an AX chassis, 20 inch barrel, and it's chambered in 308. And I noticed it's a fluted barrel with your signature muzzle brake on there. Correct. So it's the uh, AWC PSR muzzle brake and it's designed for the AWC suppressor uh, over the thread Thor PSR. And also the unique thing about this stock that I like is it's a folding stock, right? Correct. So fully adjustable. It makes it very easy to fit uh, every individual body type and, and different shooter. You can pretty much build that rifle to anything you want it to be to fit anyone you want it to fit. It's a pretty full of features. So yeah, very I, customizable. You know, we want to we want to make it easy for uh, every shooter out there to to find what they want. Now we're also using the Nexus ammunition, right? And that's, tell us about how important it is to have the proper ammo with the platform Correct. of the rifle. So, you know, Nexus ammo is really designed around surgeon rifles. So we've designed Nexus uh, to very, very tight tolerances. Um, you're gonna get the same consistency that you would get out of a lot of hand load applications. So if one of the people out home or myself wanted to buy one of those rifles, how would we go about doing that? Uh, you would either visit uh, surgeonrifles.com or uh, give us a call um, and all of our contact information is on our website. The Right Stuff is brought to you in part by Wiley X, True Spec, Pro Shot Gun Cleaning Kits, and Dripping Springs Vodka. The Right Stuff is brought to you in part by Champion Firearms, Body Armor, Fat Man Beef Jerky, and Boot Barn. American Titan Truck. Simply the best built American truck ever. Designed in California, engineered in Michigan, Tested in Arizona, assembled in Mississippi, powered by Tennessee, and Cummins in Indiana. Nissan's American Titan truck with America's best truck warranty. Welcome back as we return to the Campfire Armory. Let's hear the results of today's challenge from Will, who is with our contestants. Gentlemen, welcome to your fourth Campfire Armory. How was today's challenge, the Polaris challenge? Pretty fast, Dana? Oh yeah, very fun. I love guys, driving that thing. <laughs> we're going around those barrels like there was no tomorrow. Drew, what'd you think of it? Oh, it was awesome. Those things are nice. Yeah, it'd be nice to have a few of those, huh? It would. Absolutely. All right, well, let's get on to the results. Uh, today, with the fastest time, again, super close between you guys, was Riley again. Good job. Congratulations. <laughs> And for the best, my favorite award is the Right Stuff Bullet. And today it's gonna go with the guy that had the great sportsmanship who helped a lot of people out on this challenge, giving them advice, and that's Don. Congratulations, buddy. Yeah, there you go. You. Well deserved, well deserved. All right, gentlemen. Enjoy, go back to camp, relax, hang out, do what you need to do, get some food in you. Tomorrow, you're gonna act like a gunslinger, so I'll see you soon, okay? Peace out. At the end of day four, Raleigh and Team American Titan wins the Polaris Power Ranger and Long Range Challenge. It was speed, skill, and marksmanship that earned him the winner's bullet. Don Bryson really rose to the occasion when he helped the other competitors with advice on this challenge. By exhibiting such good sportsmanship, he earned himself the Right Stuff Bullet Award. I'm Alan Falk. I have many titles, but the main one is Program Marketing for Tannerite Sports. 
Tannerite is a small company in Pleasant Hill, Oregon, just outside of Eugene. And Daniel Tanner is the inventor and owner of Tannerite Sports. Dan created Tannerite with his grandfather, and they're looking for a way to find a report from a far range shot. Yes. That was a lot easier than seeing paper with a scope. So they came up with Tannerite. Well, people love Tannerite because mainly you get an instant report that you hit something. And you get the big cloud smoke and the big sound, and it's safe. You can use it anywhere you want, as long as the regulations allow it. Woo! You can find Tannerite at our website, tannerite.com, or most sporting goods stores have it. If they don't, ask them to get it. The Right Stuff is brought to you in part by Kingsford Charcoal, Bansbach Easy Lift of North America, and Revy. The Right Stuff is brought to you in part by American Titan, G-Shock, Armorlite, Surgeon, and Tannerite. My name is Pat Lavity. I work for Casio and I represent G-Shock. I'm a director of sales and I've been at Casio for 18 years. So G-Shock, synonymous with toughness. We're in our 35th year of G-Shock. We'll be celebrating it all year. Uh, so what is G-Shock really, right? Number one watch in the military, the watch of choice for policemen, firemen, anyone that works with their hands, anyone who wants to wear a watch and not have to worry about adjusting their lifestyle to meet with their watch limitations. So these watches are built with ultimate durability and toughness. All the shipment agency shows are perfectly in sync with what G-Shock is all about, right? This is a true outdoors show with shooting and all types of activities, climbing and swimming, whatever else your contestants are doing, these watches will withstand all of the rigors of all the competitions. So S-Series by G-Shock, basically it's G-Shock for her. So she too is G-Shock is the tagline. Slightly smaller, but still 200 meter water resistant, shock resistant, and from there a bevy of features and functions. I recommend they go to gshock.com, as well as all major department stores in the United States carry the line. Uh, so today our challenge included that Polaris Ranger, and that 800 was a beast. It was awesome. Uh, first time I've driven one like that, and was able to let go, that was fun. So when I was able to get behind that surgeon and load that round, um, that thing is absolutely a precision rifle. I mean, that's what anybody would ever ask for. I didn't realize today we were shooting that Nexus ammunition, but oh my gosh, one hit wonder. I mean, it was awesome. Butter smooth going right in, and then the minute that your trigger finger hits the spot, it was off and into the Tannerite, and what another amazing feel. Uh, so today, to prepare for tomorrow, um, I'm gonna try to make sure that I get a good night's sleep and uh, focus and just try to concentrate. That Ranger was super fun. That thing can take off and handle some dirt. Um, going in those turns, I didn't even let off the gas. I just let the wheels do its own thing. Literally the whole entire thing, nonstop, just kept romping through that dirt and that little guy could take it. I definitely would, would love to have one of those when I go out to the desert trips. The Tannerite was awesome. Big explosion, it's definitely way more satisfying than steel. Uh, the Surgeon, that was a beautiful rifle. Had a very smooth action, light trigger, great compensator so that thing wouldn't even move if you shot it. And it was dead on, even within yeah. the Nexus ammo, that stuff. Those two in a pair, perfect combination for any kind of shooter. Tomorrow, I got a little hint that we're gonna be getting a little westerned out tomorrow, so we'll see. I am a little bit of a gunslinger, so I think I can definitely sling some lead tomorrow. We'll see how it goes. Oh, today, uh, during the Polaris Challenge, we, we got to drive, uh, go go dirting, so to speak, as we say. And uh, it, it was a blast. Stirred up a lot of dust, went fast, and uh, ha had a good time. Uh, at the end of the challenge, uh, we got to shoot the uh, Surgeon rifle, and that was absolutely, that's top-end rifle. Loved it. Uh, everything is uh, silky smooth, and along with the Nexus ammo that we had, that was a winning combination. Oh yeah, uh, my right stuff bullet. I was proud to get uh, as, as important to me as uh, winning the challenge. It's uh, show camaraderie and sportsmanship. So that's uh, what I try to be all about. So uh, proud to have it. Uh, for tomorrow, we're going to uh, hopefully relax a little bit tonight. I understand we're going to have uh, possibly some uh, get our cowboy on tomorrow. So we'll uh, 
get rested up and practice our best John Wayne impersonation tonight, and we'll be ready to go tomorrow. Okay, so in the Polaris Challenge today, we got to drive a Polaris Ranger. Uh, we got to go around some barrels. Um, it handled exactly the way it, it was supposed to. Um, I basically just stayed on the gas the entire time. It handled great. Uh, got back to where um, the end point was. And then we got to jump up on the uh, Surgeon Rifle, which uh, extremely smooth action, uh, trigger was amazing. Um, and then we shot the Tannerite, which obviously uh, it, it did exactly what it was supposed to do, which was a big boom and a lot of fun to watch. So my strategy today in the challenge was uh, just to do my best Ricky Bobby impersonation and go as fast as I can uh, without messing up. Uh, I am ready for tomorrow as best I can. Uh, tonight I'm gonna get a good night's sleep, get some food, ice my ankle, and uh, hope for the best tomorrow. That Polaris challenge was awesome. I love those little Polaris things, man. They are fast and peppy, and they handle that all-terrain. I've driven other things, but nothing quite like that. And the, the power, the pickup behind it, the stopping, just beats all the rest of them that I've ever driven. Uh, my favorite part of the challenge was shooting that Surgeon rifle. That is a smooth rifle. Tan right behind it, you, you mix with that Nexus ammo, you can't miss. Tomorrow, I plan on uh, getting some good rest, having Don cook us up some dinner on the grill and then uh, getting good rest after that, and then waking up nice and fresh, and beating every, all the rest of these guys. Coming up on day five of The Right Stuff, it's time for our competitors to sling some metal in the Cowboy Action Old Western Town Challenge. Bullets will fly at the general store, saloon, and bank, where they will be using single action revolvers and a lever action rifle to hit a variety of targets and tannerite. It's a showdown in the Old West to see who will survive elimination and who has the marksmanship and speed to be the winner on the next exciting episode of The Right Stuff.